The family of a 22-year-old man shot and killed by a Vallejo police officer is blasting an arbitrator's ruling which overturned the detective's firing. Crown 4's Philippe Chagall reports now that the family of Sean Monterosa says that they will continue to pursue justice. Angry and discouraged, Sean Monterosa's family says the police arbitration process has let them down. This city has allowed for unarmed civilians, black and brown men, to be killed inhumanely. The Monterosa sisters react outside City Hall in Vallejo Thursday to an arbitrator's decision to overturn police officer Jarrett Tan's termination and order to reinstate him. Tan is the detective who shot and killed their unarmed brother. It's not just about Sean, it's about Justice. Ton's attorney Joshua Olander says in a statement that the arbitrator found Ton's use of deadly force was legally justified when he shot and killed the 22-year-old man on June 2nd, 2020. That's when officers responded to a looting call at a Walgreens. An independent report on the incident released in 2021 determined the shooting was not reasonable and that Ton mistook the hammer in Monterosa's possession for a gun. Former Chief Shawnee Williams fired Ton, but Ton's attorney says an arbitrator has determined de-escalation was not feasible, quote, because an officer who reasonably believes he is about to be shot and killed is entitled to use deadly force at that moment. This is not a time to be performative. This is a time to be an accomplice with us and to really do the work and organize and bring change to the city of Vallejo. The Monterosas have filed a federal civil rights lawsuit against the city of Vallejo and Ton, and family attorney Lee Merritt is seeking to decertify Ton. We hope to be successful in the lawsuit, and we believe that we will be, but more importantly, we must see uh, Ton incarcerated, prosecuted, and sent to prison for his crime. The State Department of Justice is investigating the deadly shooting, saying in a statement, quote, our review in this case is ongoing. We owe it to the family and community to ensure that cases involving the loss of human life are done right and supported by a thorough, fair, and comprehensive investigation. Philippe Jagal, Cron 4 News. Oakland Mayor